Okay, so here's basically what happened. So, the Kensa Wave 2, or the Kensa Weapon is Wave 2. Technically, both me and Jared were not even excited for one bit. Mostly because of what other people said. It was most likely going to be the Splat Brella, the Ink Brush, the Heavy Splatling, and the Blaster that was going to get its Kensa kit. But instead, we were wrong. There was the Sloshing Machine, or the Kensa Sloshing Machine, Kensa Lunar Blaster, Kensa Diamond Roller, and then, of course, what got Jared really excited, the Kensa Splatter Shot Pro. So then the conversation went like this. Yo, Darren. Yes. I need you to do me a really, really huge favor. And I apologize for making you want to do this, but please, just hear me out, alright? Alright, fine. Go ahead. What is it? Have you seen the Kensa Weapons Wave 2? Have you seen that one of them is the Kensa Splattershot Pro? Let me guess, you're gonna make me do that weapon or use it or something? Yes, I want you to use this weapon. I, I want to see it from your perspective, so can you just do me a solid and just, you know, make a video about it? I mean, I would have been doing a video about it right now, but I kind of care. Would you like to explain why? I'd rather not, because then that information would go public, so... Yeah. But anyways, please, can you just do it for me, please? Alright, fine. Well, you will be solid. Alright, thank you so much. So first off, one, I'm doing this video mostly because of what Jared said he wants me to do because of his all oh, his strong love for the Splatter Shop Pro and all that stuff. Two, I'm also gonna make this as a video for uh, an apology for why the Spider-Man video was so short, or the fact that the Spider-Man video was so short, that it didn't really come off as interesting as well, at least as interesting as I thought you guys might think. And three, I'm a little surprised that Jared didn't want to share information on why he can't do stuff like this. Which is kind of weird, it makes me wonder if he's somewhere secretive that he wants no one to know, which is, to me, is kind of strange. But I guess it's kind of for his safety against me and for whatever he's hiding from. But, whatever. Anyways, let's just continue with the video. So I hope you guys enjoy. So let's give it a go, shall we? Mostly doing this because, you know, uploads. And apparently, I've been forced to do this and play with the new Splattershot Pro. The Kensa one apparently, so... whoop de do, I guess. And I guess we're also playing on the new stage as well, so that's just excellent. So apparently we also got this... Wow. There is a lot of Splash Up Rose here. At least it's only other two. Alright, well let's see what they got. This so is the middle of the stage. And already there's some chaos going on. A lot of chaos. Just a lot. Oh my goodness. Alright, come on. What you guys got? Alright, there's a Splash Up right there. There we go. Just exactly what I needed. Alright, so that was my Booyah Bomb, which is a very, 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 very interesting weapon, I'd say. It's very interesting in its most ways. And I did not mean to screw me up. Oh, whatever. But it's interesting in small ways because it's like the Spear Ball from Dragon Ball Z, or in my case, the Supernova from Frieza, or that Frieza uses, and Cooler uses, or the Omega Blaster that Bowl uses. So this thing could be anything. And we can take this out just like that, that's, a, that's amazing. No, oh boy. Also, sounds like the new theme is playing. I'm not really for sure what this is, since I can't really hear my TV that well. Or the TV in this case. But you know what, that's just excellent. All around makes it a much more fun experience to play. Alright. Seems like I found my spot in terms of which I want to do. Who's over here? 
Not a Spotify Pro user. <laughs> Everyone knows. Pretty much means you're one of the only Spotify Pro users on the show. But, that's our victory. Our very quick easy victory right there. Ah, uh, wasn't too bad. I really like this Kensa Spotify Pro a lot. To be honest, this is actually one of the cooler weapons, I'm not gonna lie. But, even though we got the pulse blast, we did the least amount of effort somehow. Which is just weird. It's just like wasted effort, I guess. I don't know. It could be anything. Alright, maps and modes updated, that's just great. Alright, so I guess our new ranked mode is right maker. And I guess well, again, we're gonna give it this Kensa Spar Shop. We're gonna give the Kensa Spar Shop Pro a try because. Again, forced, and the fact the Slenderman video kind of wasn't enough. But let's give it a shot. Alright, let's see what we got here. Wow, there is a lot of people who are using this weapon. Alright, let's get started. Oh, hold on. Oh my gosh, when I just get to so terrible at any bolt stuff. Just other words. You know what I'm saying? Oh wow. There was a lot of chaos going on right there. Wow, I gained a lot of leeway. That's just nice. Oh hold up. Keep them back. Keep them back. I'll put you out of your misery. This is just a bunch of chaos, man. I'll grab the rainmaker since no one can grab it anyway. Oh boy. Oh boy. Right now, what I think is actually kind of funny is that the only capsule weapon that's being used right now is his Photoshop Pro. Man, Jared must be so happy because he loves that weapon a lot. Jeez, so he's got to expand your thoughts when it comes out of the weapon. Sure. You know, now I think about it, I wonder if it's because of so many splash up that's causing this much chaos. So I'm not gonna lie. What? Oh, it's the custom hyper spot. Nice. Alright, so surprisingly, we only went halfway through the match. And pretty much, they are really close to gaining a lot of distance. I mean, a lot. Like, I mean, they covered up the map a lot. If I had that special saver, wouldn't it? Uh, I'm defending the Rainmaker because I am not trusted to hold it. So we're up there. Alright, come on. So I guess no one wanted to grab it. That's just nice. The proper timing when we needed it, no one grabbed it. So pathetic. And guess what? Enemy team is about to grab it. All because no one wanted to grab it on the outside. And then this is about to happen. Oh boy! Well, guess who's getting the lead? They are. So thanks a lot, teammates, for not grabbing the Rainmaker. I'm just kidding you all. You could have all grabbed the Rainmaker. Instead, you guys decided not to. This will go much better than last time. For all the cases. Alright, come on. Who's there? Alright. Oh my goodness. Pretty much wasted this much because I thought there was actually someone very close to me. Can we just 
of all painting and how many shots I just put in turn, she still didn't die. That must be. You have to do a lot of shots to kill someone. Oh my gosh, who's using that Booyah Ball? So good to know. Oh my goodness, so much chaos going on, I've been quiet for that long. And we 
one. She's only just climbing a victory for once. That took, like, forever to grasp, I guess. But alright. I mean, this weapon overall is pretty dang good. I mean, obviously, I am not the best at it, I can assure you that. But I don't know what. This weapon is relatively amazing. That is all I can say. So, for this is just to not only show Jared, I guess, what is this weapon in particular capable of, but at the same time to also show you guys what it can do, and to also make up for the fact that the second of the video was not that long. So anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed watching this another of me playing of something. Even though this was not a war game in particular, which I think... I think next week might be a war game. I'm not really for sure what it is, but we'll see. Anyways, guys, hope you go. Hope you guys enjoy watching this video. If you did, give it a like if you want, share it if you want, subscribe if you want. I can't stay here forever, obviously. And I'll see you guys whatever we do next. Take care. Or have a happy Halloween. <laughs> see you there. Even though it's not Halloween.